Iowa is facing um, some water quality issues right now, some of them more regional in scale and some of them more local in scale. Uh, one of the regional ones that certainly um, has the attention of many is the Gulf of Mexico hypoxic zone, uh, an area of low dissolved oxygen in the Gulf. Uh, the goal of the hypoxia task force is to reduce the size of that zone to 5,000 square kilometers. And right now it's, you know, there's year to year variability, but it might be on the order of three times that. Um, to try to reduce that zone, um, there are recommendations, or there are goals actually, for reductions in nutrient loading down to uh, the Gulf of Mexico. And an EPA science advisory board um, developed those recommendations and their recommendations are to reduce nitrogen and phosphorus loading to the Gulf by 45%. Uh, from kind of as a result of that, the, the size, uh, the goals for reduction, the hypoxia task force identified that one of the needs is for states to develop you know, state level strategies for how they would reduce uh, nutrient loading to the Mississippi River Basin or to the Mississippi River specifically and then to the Gulf. Um, and so each of the states in the Mississippi River Basin are developing straight state nutrient reduction strategies. Iowa is one of those states that has developed a nutrient reduction strategy and looked at what practices uh, might be needed, might be available uh, to help farmers reduce that nutrient loading. As we look at reducing downstream nutrient loss, the prairie strips I think are an exciting practice that we can think about. The prairie strips, can help us reduce surface water runoff, reduce that sediment and phosphorus loss that's, that's uh, going with that surface water runoff, as well as the prairie strips, uh, depending on the siting and the kind of groundwater level conditions, uh, in many situations they may intercept shallow groundwater, uh, promoting denitrification and maybe promoting nitrate uptake by uh, that prairie community. So I think as we move forward with uh, really trying to reduce nutrient loading to downstream water bodies. I think the prairie strips concept is one of the practices, among many, but one of the practices that farmers can really look at uh, to help reduce uh, what's leaving their agricultural fields. Mm -hmm.